we skip to the good part. morning guys <clears throat> well it is another cold wet very wet rainy windy day outside <sighs> just have a shower my hair is having its one of those moods where it says you're not going to style me go get stuffed i'm just going to do my own thing thank you very much i'm just going to be easy breezy so, and i have i have dried it with the hair dryer and i have tried to style it with the uh, comb but no nah, he just does not want to do anything it's not having a bar of that it just says now nah, I'm doing what I'm doing and you're just going to have to put up with it. So I'm just putting up with it. So I was looking um, through some information last night with the, um, with the lives, especially on the uh, mobile phone. And apparently, I think I can do a live on the mobile now because I've got so many um, subscribers, flock members. I think I can do one now, but it only fully unlocks everything on the mobile as far as live goes when you reach a thousand subscribers. Um, until then, you only, you, you're limited to, I don't know what, because I haven't done it yet on the mobile. And apparently, you can actually go live and share your live with another YouTuber. So you can have two YouTubers in the one live, apparently. So that's interesting. How that works exactly, I'm not quite sure. But um, it is uh, exciting. Um, to say the least. So there you go. Mr. Eggbird over there. Uh, flexing his feathers. Yeah, flex them. Now flex your feathers. Go on. You're doing it before. Oh, now you're quiet now. I'm talking to you. Hmm? You weren't quiet before. No. No, you weren't. I'm flexing again. There you go. There you go, everybody. His morning flex. Oh, you don't want to see my dirty room. Untidy room, I should say. I've got to come in here and continue on with it. Um, the room that is. But, um, yeah, so just that. I'm going out to see the chickens, see the fluffy bum bum feathers. Um, see if they've laid any eggs. We've got six yesterday. That was a real blessing. I wonder if we get that today. Probably not, but we'll see. Um, yeah, so there we go. Um, I am thinking, because that side in front... And along the back area because that's sort of like a dead zone area like nothing really gets done much there what? 
I'm thinking about moving the plants and stuff once it's cleared. I'm thinking about moving all the plants and stuff. And then I'm thinking about um, getting proper, proper, proper gates and stuff like that. But I'm thinking about turning that whole side area into one big chicken run. One great big chicken area. And then I can like put in really good, because I found a guy in Maui, I think it is, um, who does sliding chicken nest boxes. And what, what that is, is the chickens go in them and they lay their eggs, but instead of the eggs staying in there for them to peck at and break or them accidentally sit on them too hard or step on them and they break or whatever, um, as soon as the chicken has laid them, it ro little egg rolls down the ramp and it goes into another little box and that's got a lid on it on the outside and the chickens can't get to the eggs so they can't they can't peck them or anything or destroy them um, they can't damage the egg at all and you just open the lid up and if there's an egg but if there's an if there has been an egg laid it's in that section where the lid is so i'm going so i'm getting their 45 dollars each though for a single and i'm only getting singles at the moment because i can't lift a lot so um i'm figuring well singles are better than nothing so and see if i get a double that's like two in one um that's 65 and i can't really afford 65 even though it would probably be cheaper um 65 70 I mean, I'd be saving fifteen dollars, wouldn't I? Um, yeah, I might save up the extra and just get a double. Mm. Yeah, I might do that because I'd be saving fifteen. And since I am, and then I could put that fifteen. See, because if I got. I'd be saving more than that because if I got all singles at 45 each that's to get two that's what $90 but yet if I paid $65 I'd get two so I think getting the two is is a better saving than getting just one so at a time so um so that's what I'm going to eventually do. I'm going to uh, replace the ones that are eventually replace the ones that are in there with these rolling ones, um, and um, make an area um, around the around the side, around the side, and um, convert that into the chicken area run thing. Because that means they've got like they've got they've still got all the dirt and everything that they can forage around in, um, and get their worms and all of that sort of thing. Um, I can put a I can put a um, I can put like a little door thingy in the jiggle um, in the gates I can barricade the gate up so you can't get to to the gate um, like you can't open the gate and stuff like that I'll, I'll get it fixed so that it you know it's completely up there and everything um, and then I will um, Yeah, oh, I think I will, because in that way they can keep all the weeds down and the grass down and 
all that sort of thing and um, still be able to get in there and yeah I think I will I think that'd be good um, and then I can still let them out in the main yard if I want to yeah and I'll just put a lock on the gate and everything and then if I want to because I've done that I can put boards at the front so nobody can see in to see where what what's there Yeah, might be a good idea. Might be, you know. <sighs> what, really? So, yeah, so we'll see how we go. Anyway, that's an idea. Let me know what you think. Um... Because that's quite a big, that's quite a big area. That's nearly the whole length of, it's over half the length of the house. So it's, it's quite big. So, um, let me see what else. Um. trying to think what else there is today there's nothing much really else to do except for cleaning up the house a bit more and cleaning the car and but it's so wet outside I'm not doing the car um I might end up going down the road maybe just to get out of the house for a little bit um yeah I can't really do anything in the yard because it is just look I'll show you hang on I mean look at the sky this is horrible <coughs> and it's just non-stop rain Actually, I might drive them in because, you know, there could be some places that are flooded. And then I could get some footage of some floods. Wouldn't that be exciting? Hmm. Hmm. I think I'll do that. And I might actually make I might actually make a saving pole. I've just had an idea. I've just had an idea. How cool. But I'm going to have to go and get some bags. Or at least another one anyway. Yeah. I'll go do that, hey. And I'll let you know what I'm doing. I'll do it. And then I'll take a video of it. And I'll explain how I did it. Yeah. And the theory about around it. You want to come? No, you can't come because it's wet and rainy and cold and windy. And I'm only going to be in and I'm going to be out. I mean, I'm not even going to be in there 10 minutes.
And if you seriously think I'm going to go and get the pram and everything out, which takes a good five minutes to set up, to spend less than ten minutes in the shop, you can think again. Hmm. Yeah, really, yeah. So I'm going to go get look at see if the chickens have um, laid some eggs. And if they have, I'll have those before I go out. Because if I have something to eat before I go out and something to drink, then I don't need or I don't feel that need to buy something to eat and something to drink down the road. And then that saves me money. So there you go. And I might just get an apple. I might get one apple. And um, bring that back. And I'll have half. And I'll give half to Eggie and Bean. Um, and then I'll get the seeds. And then we'll go through it together. And we'll uh, get, these, get these seeds growing. So there you go. So Okay, well, I'll catch up with you guys in about... seconds. See you in a couple of seconds. Okay, I'm, at, I'm down the road. As you can tell, I'm in the car. It was hailing before. It's windy, it's cold, it's still wet, and it was hail um, just before. So that, so much so that a big W have been closed for, God, I don't know how long today, due to a blackout that they had they had no power as you can see in this so what I did was I went and I got my bag that I told you I was going to get and I'll show you what I'm going to do with that later um, and then I got I didn't get one I got two apples but I got two different types I got I got a pink lady which is this one here. I'm keeping it in the bag for now. So that's a pink lady. So I'll, I'll get seeds off that. Now that one only cost me... $0.77. Cents. And providing the seeds all germinate, I could make over a hundred dollars on that 77 cents so that's it's that's a good profit right and then I got this one here because it just looked interesting and I liked the name of it now this is a royal gala G A L A I've never heard of them before, but apparently they're this is huge. And I don't know even I don't even know what they taste like. And that one cost me ninety cents. So this is getting up into the really good stuff. This one. So um. Oh, I can actually, because it's got a little taggy sticker on it. So I can take them out of the bag. Okay, that's what it looks like. That's what the Royal Gala looks like. And then the Pink Lady looks like... Lady. So these have all got little taggy stickers on them. And that's the pink lady. Very different in texture, aren't they? It's 
So they're the two apples. So we're going to get. So I've got a lucky bag for this one, and I've got a lucky bag for this one, and we're going to get the seeds out of them when we get home, and we're going to see if we can germinate them. Now apparently they've got the seeds have to stay in the fridge for about two to three weeks. Um, because they've got to think that they're winter and then they should be I think they germinate they sprout and stuff um, inside the lock bags and then they think okay yeah that's cool we we've been through winter and we can start to grow now and uh, so when they've germinated and I can tell that they've got little growths coming out of them and stuff then I will transport them into those zip bag pot plant holders that I have and I will put those outside um, so that they can grow into trees and then when they're about when they're about that high then I'll put them up for sale and, uh, and I'll do that with all the apples and uh, I should get quite a good variety of apple trees. So, um, so there you go. So anyway, I'm going to go home, get out of this weather. I'm lucky I'm in the car. It's nice and warm in here. I'm going to get out of the weather and um, oh, look at that, my eyebrow is growing back. Thank God for that. When I ripped it off with all that um, latex, fake skin, liquid, liquid latex. Um, yes, so I'm going to go home, I'm going to get out of this weather. Lucky I had those eggs and that drink of Coke. Otherwise I would have been so tempted to have bought something. But because I've already eaten and I've already had something to drink, um, I haven't, you know... My brain has said, let's buy something to eat and let's get something to drink, you know. But my stomach has said, no, we don't need it. Taste buds have said, hmm, think, think we will. And then, uh, and then my, well, I'll, I'll rephrase that. My taste buds and 5% of my brain has said, Let's get something to eat down here, down in the shopping centre. My stomach has said, nah, I don't need it. I'm not hungry and I'm not thirsty. And then the other percentage in my brain has said, no, you're not getting it because you're getting your camera set up first. So there you go. So there you go. So, um... I will be doing another vlog on my idea, on my journey of saving up. And uh, we'll go through that together. And if it helps you guys out um, to save. I mean, I, I know I did one once before um, with a little thing. but And that worked great for me for a while. But what I really needed it for really... It didn't really suit the purpose anymore so I, I moved on from that and then I moved on to something else um, which is really good don't get me wrong it's really good um, but again it it just turned out that I needed something else so I'm going to do it this way so um, I will I will show you guys when I've done it and uh and then i will take you we will go along together with my um with my savings um to get this set up and uh to see if i can get debt free get some of these really big things out of the way and uh and you guys can you know help me can help me do it you can you can say hey Shelly can't have that you don't need that you're saving for this you've come such a long way or you've just started don't don't you dare keep your money and you don't need that 
You may want that, but you don't need that. You know? You want and you need Saba. So there you go. <laughs> and I might also try that live too before I go inside. But I'm going to do that when I'm um, at the house. Because then I can suck the internet from the uh, house internet instead of using it off my credit. So there you go. So I'm going to start the car. It is so windy out there. So I'm just I'm just really waiting for it once I'm home. I'm waiting for it to rain again for the girls to all be inside their chicken house. And then I'll lock them up because they've all had a big drink and everything. And they've got food in their chicken house. Um, so I will wait and then I will uh, pop them in there. Well, they'll be in there themselves. And then I can let Lolly back out again. So there you go. So with that, I will catch you guys at home. See you there. Okay, I'm home. Hey everyone. Well, it is uh, 10, 10 23 p.m. So I'm just up just editing and uploading um, we my internet provider lost internet for about four and a half hours eggy what are you doing come on come up here and say hello to everybody step up say hi yeah you want to say hi Look at that handsome face, look. Who could not love a face like that? Isn't he the most beautiful bird? He's just so gorgeous. You? You? You, Eggy? You, my little Eggy? You want to tell everybody what you've had to eat today? Hmm? You want to tell everybody? You say, well, I've had some fruit. What are you doing? You've turned it around. Now look, you can't turn it around. There you go. You say, I've had some fruit. And some eggs. I'm going to get me veggies. Yep. And then I'm going to go to sleep. When mum's finished. Yeah. When mum's finished, I'm going to go to sleep. And we're both going to listen to the rain. But really, I don't care. Yeah, we can listen to the rain. Hey, eh? can listen to the rain. Cute look. There's my eggy. He's such a good boy. Such a good boy. Look at that face. So handsome. So handsome. He's been up on top of the chair having a sleep. Haven't you? Yeah. So the internet lost power. So we were without internet for four and a half, five hours. Just when I was editing one of the uh, vlogs for today, for tonight. Um, 
you've got a live coming up. I worked out I can do them on the phone. So uh, you've got one coming up tonight in around about, I think, 45 minutes. It should be up and viewable. be up and viewable so that'll be good um, you've got another one coming up of my budgeting that I did today so that's coming up and then once that's fully uploaded I am editing and uploading another one um, and while that's uploading, I'll do that when I go to bed. So I'll just let it upload while I'm in bed. So, um, so you'll get that. So you'll get three tonight. Um, so I think three. One. Don't egg. One. Yeah, that's three, I think. So, so that'll be good. Um, let me see, we have got a new flock member. We have well, thumbs up. Not sure who it is, but we have got a new subscriber. So the nest has expanded. So we've got 55. How cool is that? So, um, come on guys, let's subscribe. We're trying to get to our, to our goal. So that would be really cool. Um... That's it, really. I've got my um, doctor's appointment, as I said, I've got my doctor's appointment tomorrow to see my specialist about my pageants. So we'll see how we go. Don't you dare nibble at my belly. No. Um, so with that, I think I am going to wish you guys a great night. Um, I'm going to say good night. I hope you all have a fantastic night. Please stay safe out there. It is wet. It is cold. It is windy. So please make sure you, if you are going to drive in it, please make sure you stay safe. And I'll catch you tomorrow. Say good night, guys. God bless and have a good one.